So hi, what's up? It's your boy Sports Wizard, and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today we're gonna bring Zara versus South US Open for a run. So let's get right into it. So my prediction is Zara and stretch that score at six four six three six four mode easy. So yeah, it should be pretty easy for Zara. But let's get to the elevation. So. Zverev has a good forehand, he has solid serve, but it's also not consistent. He has good ground strokes, he's not a great mover, but he can still reach balls. And he's a base liner. He went to the US Open final, all straight up in semifinals. Roman Gros semifinals and Wobble in fourth round. He has 15 titles and he's number four on the road. He won the ATP finals and he won the Olympics. Or Sock, he went to the Austrian Open and Wobble in third round. Roman Gros and US Open fourth round. He has four titles. He's number 192. His highest rank was actually number eight in the world. He went to the ATP Tour Finals semifinals. Uh, he went to the Olympics first round. He's an aggressive base runner. He can play both offense and defense. He has a top spin forehand. He has a good serve. He pushes the opponent to the baseline. baseline. The hatter was 2 1 suck, and, then, and on hard, it's 2 1 suck. So in the first set, I think it's very well aggressive. He's going to hit winners. He's going to hit aces. He's going to make Sock move around. Well, Sock, I mean, he's still going to hit winners, but I think, like, uh, it's going to be tough for him to, you know, return his Zverev's balls. And even if he tries to push his Zverev to the baseline, Zverev is already going to be in the baseline. And he can make Zverev move, but move, but Zverev can still reach balls, so he won't really do that much. So, yeah, basically, Zverev, he'll hit winners, hit aces, make Sock move around. Sock will hit winners and try to make Zverev move around, but I don't think it'll really work. And, he, and it's also going to be a struggle for him to return Zverev's balls. So, Zverev will win the first set. In the second set, I think it's going to be almost the same thing. Zverev hitting winners, hitting aces, making Sack move around, rallying with them. Or Sack, I mean, he's going to hit winners. But again, it'll be tough for him to return Zverev's balls. And even if he tries to make Zverev move, Zverev can, like, it actually, he's not a, he's not a great mover, but he can still move and reach balls. So that won't really work that much either. And eventually, Zverev will win the second set. In the third set, I think, um, as well, like I said, he'll just keep trying to rally with them, find a good spot to win a winner, just keep continuing to, hit, continuing to hit aces. And basically, one thing as well has to look out for is like he can't really hit that many double faults because sometimes his serve is not consistent. So, like, if he keeps his serve in control, I think it should be fine. Whereas, Sock, I mean, again, like I said, he's gonna be like he has to like move really well in this match if he wants to stand a chance. And also, like I said, like he has to be able to return Zverev's balls, move very well, consistently hit winners. But I still think Sock can hit winners, but I don't think he's, he's going to be able to, like, you know, keep rallying with Zverev and returning his balls. So eventually, I think Zverev will win the third set and win the match. So throughout the whole match, Zverev will hit winners, hit aces, make Sock move around, rally, rally with Sock, where Sock is going to hit winners. Um, he, I don't think he can really return the rest of the balls. I don't think he can keep the rally, and I think he might hit a, like a few uh, unforced errors. So eventually, the variable will come out on top. So yeah, I guess that's the prediction. Please make sure to like, subscribe, and turn on those notifications. Guys, I really appreciate it if you guys like, subscribe, and turn on those notifications. And I'll see you next time. Peace.